right. Can we do it at the lot? Yeah, I will. Good morning, everybody. Welcome to, to Camp, Camp Kindergarten. Garden. For Didn't our see excuse me. For our 2020 2021 school year. Today is our first day, and for those of you who No, have, it's my first day of school. It is, too. Why don't you scooch back a little bit? Um, it is Kinsey's very first day of school today, and guess what? This is Kinsey's school. Camp Kindergarten is going to be Kinsey's preschool this year because she is staying home and Wells is e-learning. Wells is going to be, she's not going to be, she is in first grade this year. So she's got a lot of work um, to do today and her work starts at 10 o'clock. So she's going to join us for a little bit this morning and then she's going to just go have a little time to herself. Um, since she has so much Barbies. work to do later today. Yeah. Playing Barbies. Uh, for those, okay girls, it's my turn. For those of you who have never been part of Camp Kindergarten, um, every morning when we come on our cam, our, um, the show, um, I use my phone to record. Cover your mouth, please. Something might be a little different. We're doing Camp Kindergarten upstairs. We'll talk about that in a minute. And, girls... I was already about to say what did that we talk in the what, did, what did we talk about this morning? We didn't really talk. Okay. Um, I have to pull up, um, the, because of the way that my phone is, I can't see us on the phone. I have to use the, the um, back of my phone. So I have to pull up um, my Facebook page on my computer to make sure that what you guys are seeing is like that we're in the picture. So every time we start class together, I'm going to pull that up. And normally... I will have that pulled up ahead of time, but it was a very busy morning this morning. Yeah, we were, there was a big storm last Yay. night, and it kind of had us sleep in longer than we usually would. There was a big storm. And I and Wells and I kind of slept through it. No, you did not. No, for just a little bit. You girls were in my bed uh, for a few hours last night. Oh, there we are. Okay, great. We've got some people seeing it, and it's good. We're going to open that up. We're watching ourselves on the computer. Um, last time we we used to give ourselves give everyone a minute before we would start so that mm -hmm. everyone can get on and situated. That's right. All right. Um, did you want to introduce? Did you did you want to introduce yourselves, girls? Stop. Um, my name's Stop. Kinsey. Come here. My name's Kinsey. Tell everybody how this is Kinsey. How old are you? Four and a Kinsey is four and a half years old, and this is Kinsey's last year of preschool. Next year, what grade will you be in, Kinsey? Kindergarten. Kindergarten. And what is exciting about kindergarten for you? Wells is in kindergarten. Well, you will be in the same school as Wells, right? That's what's mm -hmm. exciting for you. Thank mm -hmm. you for sharing. You could have the Excuse same Excuse me. Teacher. It is her turn. Who are, who are you? My name is Wells, six and a half years old. September 11 is my birthday, and... Friday's oh, my birthday. I forgot to mention one little thing. What did you forget to mention? Thank you for sharing. Not on my half birthdays, on my whole birthday, like my birthday party. But my birthday is the first day of winter. Her birthday is the first day of winter. All right, let's get a move on, and then we will talk about the room that we're in. We're going to sing our good morning song and see how we're feeling today. No, we don't need these yet, sweetheart. I'll grab my guitar and my pick. Why can't we do how we're feeling? To build hers out during no, the class. No, no, but I, it's you my can, first day of school. It is your first day of school. Wells but and Kinsey are checking out these sheets that say, My name is, and they'll fill in their name, and then um, they're going to be good listeners, aren't they? Um, and how they're feeling, what the weather is, what day of the week it is, and how they are feeling. And I put these in some sheet protectors, and they're going to use whiteboard markers so uh -huh. that we can erase them each day. What color do you use? And Wells, after we're done with the song and we talk about the room, and then you're going to go to Rainbow. your room and play, okay? Today. 
Are you feeling happy? Not Are you no. feeling mad about something? Can you please stop talking when I'm talking? Are you feeling sad? Shh. Are you feeling tired? Are you feeling... What else can we be feeling? We can be feeling... Maybe a little frustrated about something? I'm a little frustrated right now because we had a talk before camp dinner started and I asked them, I said, do you think all of your friends watching are going to want to listen to you guys arguing and bickering? And they said, no. So we talked about having, um, being good listeners and making good choices. And she ignored. And I need you guys to stop right now. I, I don't want green. I want I'm going to put this bucket in the middle and she can pick her own. Well, Mom, you Hello, everybody. Tap your head. kindergarten in the springtime, just a minute, I'm talking. When we started camp kindergarten in the springtime, um, we didn't think that we were going to be doing this for a very long time. And so we set up a little space in the basement and it worked out just fine. Um, but sometimes the internet didn't work and the lighting wasn't great and it was in the basement. So then this summer, where's the lid? This summer we moved camp kindergarten up to the playroom. But that lighting was really difficult because... It had a glare just, the whole time. Yeah, that was a little tricky. So, we transformed Kinsey's old bedroom into the, the learning, learning room. room. And the camp kindergarten. And the camp kindergarten. So, Wells, I'll show you in just a second where Wells does all of her e-learning. And this is what you'll get to see every day when you're with us. So, let's take a look here and see what we see. So I'm going to pick this up and I'm going to move it so you can see everything in the room. So there's the doorway where we walk in and then you'll see at the very top. What do you see at the top? Wells, can you tell me what is that white? Hey, it's my first day of school. Yes, you'll do the next one. Wells, can you tell me what that white banner is at the very top? What is on that white banner? Numbers up to 100. Numbers up to 100. Look at that. They go all the way around the corner. Through the doorway. Over to the doorway. And around. Where's the eraser? There. And now, Kinsey, can you tell me what is below the number line? What is that that has all those letters on it? Animal that has it. Animals that start with the letters. That is the alphabet. We'll be singing the alphabet almost every day. Wells, what is below the alphabet? What are those? We sing them. Days of the week. Not days of the week. Not yet. What is up there? Month. Jane. Months of the year. Every day we will sing our months of the year. Kinsey, what is below the the months of the year in blue. The cha-cha-cha. The cha-cha-cha, the days of the week. Very good. We have a little number chart over here. 
We have an can alphabet chart. Me? Can I show you this? Um, no, I'm talking right now. Please sit down. Please sit down. Thank you. I want to show you. Um, we have our, our whiteboard that I will put a message on every day, and we'll go through that together. We have our calendar, which we will talk about every day. Um, over here, we have some sight words, which we'll get into that a little bit later. I'm going to show you the rest of the room. I have some lights on without lampshades because it's very dark and gloomy today, and uh, we like needed some light. Rainy. So on this wall over here, this is going to be our, our um, alphabet wall. Every week, we're going to learn a new letter, and as we learn new letters, we're going to put pictures up of words that start with those letters, and we'll put them on this wall over here. And finally, I'll show you. This is well. This is Wells's workspace. When she has e-learning, she sits at this table. She puts her iPad on this little um, container, and all of her materials are over here. And she does her e-learning over here. So this is our setup up here, and I'm glad that you were, that everybody is joining us. Mom, you should take in my making bed. Well, it's time for you to go in your room now. I just want to show them what it was like last night. What? Tell us. So, this is what it was like last night. Oh, yes. Thank you. Can you put that back now, please? That's what we had last night. A big storm. Right. We stayed up for like two hours. Thanks, until Wells. it was done. Can you say goodbye to everybody? And head off. Bye. Bye. I'll be back. Just not right now. All right. Kinsey, it's time to get on with our day. Let's sing our oh. um, alphabet song. Okay. Yeah. It might be tricky to do. You know, we're not going to do the alphabet right now. I've got to figure out a better place to put the phone to see it. Let's start with our months of the year. All right, Kins, we are not making um, no, marker. No, no. no way. I, I just almost finished my new marker towel. All right, and then we're going to put this aside because this is distracting. Okay, come on over. Pick, like a, pick a pointer, my sweet child of mine. All right, here we go. Are you guys ready for the months of the year? What? Okay, you can do it yourself. All right, here we go. A one. Oh, maybe you can. We're starting over here. A one. A two. A one. Two. Three. Four. January, February, March, April, May. April, May. We go outside and play, play, play. June. All over here. July, August, and September. Back to school, hey, so we remember. School. Yes, that's right. October, November, and December. We know our months, so we end the song here. We know our months, so we end the song here. Very nice job. All right, Kinsey, we're going to move on to our days wait, of the week. Wait, mommy. What, sweetheart? Did you know that my... Everyone, did you know that my birthday is a birthday of winter? Yes, you told me. two winters on here. Yes, okay. What month are we going to put in here? Uh, what month are we in? You just told us. September. September, very good. Do you want to put that in there for me? Yep. Thank you. Put that down a little bit so you guys can see. There we go. What? I said. All right. What now, Kinsey, are we going to... Nope, we're not doing that yet. We're not doing that yet. We need to do our days of the week. What song would you like to do? We know three songs for our days of the week. Um, your cha cha cha. We know the days of the week song. We know the Sunday Monday song, and we have Miss Megan's cha cha cha. And we have the other cha cha cha. Right. All right. You ready? Days of the week. Your cha cha. This is my cha cha cha. Days of the week. Yeah. Days of the week. Days of the week. Yeah. Sunday, Monday. Cha, cha, cha. Tuesday, Wednesday. Cha, cha, cha. Thursday, Friday. Cha, cha, cha. Saturday. Cha, cha, cha. Let's try that one more time. And if you at home were not standing up and joining us, I want you to stand on up and get your cha-cha-chas ready to cha-cha-cha, okay? So stand on up. Here we go. Days of the week. Days of the week. Yeah. Days of the week. 
days of the week. Here we go. Sunday, Monday, cha, cha, cha. Tuesday, Wednesday, cha, cha, cha. Thursday, Friday, cha, cha, cha. Saturday, cha, cha, cha. All right, why is this all blurry? I don't know why it's all blurry. Where's the eraser? Hold on, I gotta see if this is gonna focus, sweetheart. So this, this is not, this, this is coming in a little blurry. But it's not blurry on my phone, so it must just be Facebook. So we're gonna keep going. Mommy, All right. wait, I can't find the erasers. Well, we don't need the erasers. No, right now. I want an eraser to make a new one. No, it's not time a to new, do that. A new purple. Thing All right, Kenzie, let's purple. see here. What day of the week is it today? How are we gonna figure that out? You know what? We might not be able to figure it out right yet. Let's go on to our calendar and see. Why is that so blurry? Let's go on to our calendar and see what number we're going to put in. And then we'll figure what, out what, what day of the week it is. Hold on. Scooch over to the side so everybody can see, okay? Let's all, I'm going to actually bring you a little bit closer. Maybe it won't be so blurry. It's in focus. Oh, good. Okay. Awesome. Thank you guys for letting me know. Um, I'm going to move you guys a little bit closer so that you can see a little bit better the calendar. Okay, so let's get you guys a little bit closer. There we go. Let's see if we're in focus. All right. Great. All right, Kinsey. Oh, sweetheart, please don't do that. Okay, first of all, would you like to use my pizza pointer? Or my finger pointer? Why not the big pointer? You want to use the big pointer? I guess I'll use the pizza. The pizza pointer. Okay. Because it's new. Let's count and see what comes wow. next. Wow. What's this, everyone and mommy? Okay. Are you ready? I want everybody at home to help us count. We're going to start with number one, and we're going to stop when we get to the blue space. Okay? Here we go. One, two, three, four, five. Come over here. Six, seven. Kenzie. Eight. That's right. We're gonna put the number eight next. Now, Kenzie, before we find the hold on, before we find the number eight, let's figure out what no, our. Let's give mommy a hug. Let's give mommy a hug. I love hugs. Mm. Let's figure out what color the apple is going to be. Red. Okay. Well, let's see. We got it. We have to. Do our pattern to see what the color is going to be, all right? No, so no let's, well, don't tell them. It's going to be a surprise. Okay. Let's say the colors together. Here we go. When I point to the apple, say the color. Green, red. Green, red. Green, red. Green. What color is going to come next? What color do you think is going to come next? What do you think, Kins? Yeah. Red. Very good. If you said red, great job. All right. Now, Kinsey, I'm going to have you scoot over to this side over here so everybody can see. Now, Kinsey, how do we figure, Kinsey, eyes up here. How do we figure out where, what day of the week it is today? We just put this eight in here. How do we figure out what day of the week it is? It starts with the number eight. No. Let's take a look over here. Put your eyes on the number eight. Okay, come stand up over here. Stand up, please. Thank you. Put your finger on the eight and pull your finger up. Now, what day of the week is this? Look at this. Look here. No, no, I didn't. You're gonna find it. What day of the week? What do you see here? Very it, good, Kins. It's, no, it's a surprise. Okay. Can you get it, or is it a little too tall? Let's see here. Kinsey, how are we going to figure this out? How do we figure out what this word says? We don't know how to read it. How will we figure that out? What can we do to figure out what this word is right here? No, let's see. Let's look back up here. Let's sing our cha-cha-cha. Now. Sunday, Monday, cha-cha-cha. <gasps> what is this? What is this? Tuesday. Tuesday. Very 
good. So we're going to come over Tuesday, here. Tuesday is a very rainy day. Yes, yeah, so let's take a look at this word Tuesday. Kinsey, what letter does Tuesday start with? What T. letter? It starts with the letter T. What sound does T make? T. Very good. T -t -t. All right, so we're going to put it up here where it says today is. Hey, Wallace, can you sing a little bit more quietly, please? Thank you. All right, Kinsey. If today is Tuesday, what was yesterday? Oh. What was that? Yesterday was? Monday. Monday. Let's look at that word. Start Monday this. starts with what letter? M for mom. M. And what sound does M make? Mm. Mm. For, for mom. All right, so we're going to put it up here where it says yesterday was. hey -ya. Put her up there. Great. And if today is Tuesday, what will tomorrow be? What will tomorrow be? Will you lift me up? No, not on Put it back there. There you go. Tomorrow will be? Wednesday. Wednesday. Let's take a look at that word. Can you show everybody that word? It starts with because it, because Wells' name starts with a W. That's right. Kinsey's making a connection. W w Wednesday and starts with a W and mommy w starts, Wells starts with a W. And Mommy starts with a and Mommy starts with an M and Monday starts with an M. Alright, put that up there. And then we're going to sing another little song. Alright, very good. Now repeat after oh, me. What is it gonna, mommy, where did you put the eraser? I don't know. Today, re repeat after me. When I say repeat, oh you guys can't see, can you see that? Yeah, you can. When I say repeat after me, that means you're going. Kinsey, don't don't touch that, please. They can see your right front and the camera, but Great. not up high. Okay. When I say repeat after me, it means I'm going to say something, they can and then shh, the blue one. Kinsale, please stop talking. I'm going to say something, and then you're going to say it after me. Okay. So repeat after me. That means I go first. Today is. Tuesday, your turn. I'm going to go like this when it's your turn. Kinsey, help me out. To Tomorrow. No, nope. today is Tuesday. My turn. Tomorrow. Yes. No, nope. my turn. Yesterday was Monday. Today. Your turn. Tomorrow. Yes. Kinsey, you got to repeat after me. That means I go look at my no, eyes. Don't tell them. No, they have to know what they're doing. No, Please stop. I'm going to tell them. Please stop putting your arms on that, okay? And I'll take that balloon. We're not playing with balloons right now. Come on over here, please. I go first. Yesterday was Monday. Your turn. Yesterday was Monday. Good. My turn. Tomorrow will be Wednesday. Your turn. I already said it. Tomorrow will be Wednesday. I want you to be a good listener and I want you to follow directions, okay? Can you do me a favor and can you shut that door for me, please? Thanks. So we can't hear Will's coming? That's right. Because Will's is being a little loud singing. That's okay, because she's in her room. Doing her own thing. All right. Let's see here. All right, we did that. We did that. I think it's time for a little movement break. So, we're going to sing a little song. Kinza needs your help. We'll do that in a minute, okay? Where is the um, eraser? There's an eraser right there, okay? But right now, we're going to shake our sillies out. I'm going to shake, shake, shake my sillies out, shake. Shake, shake them out. Shake your sillies out. Shake, shake, shake my sillies out. And wiggle my waggles away. I'm going to stretch, stretch, stretch my sleepies out. Stretch, 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 stretch them out. Sleepies out. Stretch, stretch, stretch my sleepies out. And wiggle my waggles away. I'm going to clap, clap, clap my clappies out. My clappies out, clap, clap, clap. My clappies out, wiggle my waggles away. Get ready to jump. I'm going to jump, jump, jump. My jumpies out, jump. Good job, kids. Jump, jump. My jumpies out, jump, jump, jump. My jumpies out, and wiggle my waggles away. Sit down. Oh, I'm getting hot. Okay. Now is it time? 
All right, Kinsey would like to show you what she's doing. No, we no, to go on is with it the time weather. to is it time to do this? You can do that. That's right. No, but is it time? Yes, it's time. But look, first I want to show you something that was made all by yourself. This one and this one. This one's my favorite color because my favorite color is purple. Okay. Wells was feeling happy and tired this morning. Kinsey, how are you going to fill yours out? Um, it's going to be a surprise. It's going to be a surprise. Okay, well, while, why don't you sit over here while you're doing that? Mom, oh. did you put my big marker stack? While you're doing that, Don't I'm break gonna... it. Don't break it. I, please don't talk to me like that. Mommy, mommy. While you're doing that, I'm going to go on with the weather because we need to do what's the weather. What's the weather? What's the weather? What's the weather like today? Is it sunny? Is it rainy? Is it snowy out today? What's the weather? What's the weather? What's the weather like today? Is it windy? Is it cloudy? Is it foggy out today? What is the weather like where you are? We like to take a peek outside. I'm going to show you what outside looks like here. It is a very overcast, rainy day here today. Stormy rainy day. So we're gonna put up there. Yeah, you can put stormy up. It's stormy. It is cloudy, and it is there. You go. Rainy, and what's the temperature like outside, Kins? Cool. It is cool. It is it. We have four types of temperature on our little weather graph or our little weather guy up here. Hot, which means, whoo, I want to go jump in a swimming pool or a lake. Uh, I'm going to wear shorts and t shirts and sandals. We have cool. Hot? No, we have warm, which means. You probably are fine outside without a jacket, wearing shorts, but it's not like sweaty hot. We have cool, which means you're probably going to wear maybe some long pants and a short sleeve shirt, or maybe shorts and a long sleeve shirt, maybe a light jacket. And we have cold, which is brr, so cold it might snow. I need to put on my hats and my mittens and my gloves and my coat and all that good stuff. So today we're going to say it's stormy, rainy, cloudy, and cool. And what we're going to do... Where did it go? Because it, it is. Because it stormed last night and it stormed today. We have this lovely weather graph that we're going to work on for the month of Wait, September. Wait, that's, that's your weather graph. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to take a marker and here. I have my own weather graph. And, and I'm going to write down. the month that we are in. What month are we in, Kinsey? Do you guys remember what month we said it was? Um. Tuesday. January, February, March, April, May. You can't see that, can you? Tuesday. Go outside and play with them. June, July, August, and, August, and September. September. So we're going to write September. No, September's my sister's birthday. S E. And September's coming up because September's. I need my your good listening birthday. ears on right now. It is not time to talk. S E P T E M B E. All right, Kinsey, what are we going to color in today? Oh. You need to use one of your markers. Mommy! Mommy! What? Mommy, these are my... Are you going to color for me or no? Or I'm going to do this on my own. I'm going to do this. Well, let right. me think about Well, I need to keep wait, moving wait, on. Wait, Mommy, Mommy, you can use one of my other purples. Thank you. All right, we are going to color in cloudy. We're going to color in rainy. And we're going to color in, oh, we can color in windy today. It's windy out. Mommy, How can you tell that it's windy out, Kins? Because um, it stormed. No, look outside. What are your clues that tell you that it's windy today? The trees are moving. The trees are moving. Very good. What? Now, as we continue with our month of September, uh, we will graph the weather each day. And at the end of September, oh, really? shh, we will see what type of weather did we have the most of, what type of weather did we have the least of, and 
and maybe what type of weather we didn't have at all. Now, my weather graph it might look a little different than your weather graph. You can get a weather graph um, on my Etsy site under the introductory packet. All right. Mommy? What, um, what do we do up here? You need to write your name up there. Okay. Now, while you're doing that, we are going to do something that we did not do in the springtime. We are going to talk about how many days we've been in school. Now, uh, we kind of sort of did this, but we're going to do something new this time. after N of my name? K-I-N-Z. Z. Now, over here I have um, some things that we're going to do every day. Okay? Uh, well, this is Z is another I. Yes. I have three bins. One, two, three. And these bins have words on them. This word says hundreds, this word says tens, and this word says ones. We are going to make a number for how many days we have been in school. Today is our first day of school. And so, my first day of school. we are Look. going to take, good job, Kinsey, we're going to take one. Did you notice that the circle's my E? Mm -hmm. I need for you to stop talking right now while I'm talking, okay? We're going to take one straw because this represents the number one. This is what a one is. One straw, one thing. One marker, one balloon, one eraser, one straw. We're going to take this straw. Kinsey, can you take this straw and put it in the ones container? Right here. Very good. We have one straw in the ones container. And let's flip this number over. And what are we going to find? Very good. Let me see. Oh, that's not correct. I have to put them in backwards. The number is one. Okay. Mommy, can, can you switch over to me? The switch number over. is. Now, Mommy, are there the any straws? Are there any straws in the tens container? Do you see any? I don't. So if there are none, that means there, there are zero. Zero means that there aren't any. So we're going to put a zero in here. And do you see any straws in the hundreds container? No. Do you see any in there? I don't no. see any in there. So what number are we going to put in front of the hundreds container? Zero. What number do you think means zero. that there's nothing there? Zero. Another zero. Very good. Can you put that right in here? Thank you, Kins. All right, now the last thing we're going to do is we're going to look and see here is one square. And we're going to put one square in front of the ones. Mommy. So how many days have we been in school? One. All right. Let's see here. We need to move on to our, you know what, it's time for a song. Let's do a song. Um, you, we are September. Oof. We are September, Mommy. What's going on? Uh, that, those are the days of the week. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. What day is today? Tuesday. Tuesday, very good. Oh, here comes the, the age-old uh, problem of Miss Megan losing her pick every time I put it down. So, good thing I brought a couple more up. All right, we're going to do a song. It is a Miss Megan original song. This is one that I came up with when uh, we were in the height of the pandemic and everybody needed to wear masks, even though everybody still does need to wear masks. And it was a very new thing. This is called Got My Mask On. You ready? If you are at home, feel free to get up and move around and dance and if you know the song you can sing the song too all right here we go doctors and nurses dentists and vets firefighters too let's not forget these superheroes helping us
love to be up and singing and dancing around with you guys, but it just takes a little bit of uh, time to move the camera back and have it at the right angle and all that stuff. So I hope that you all were singing and dancing along and getting some energy out. That is called Got My Mask On, which is a Miss Megan original song, and that is up on music platforms all over the place under Miss Megan's Camp Kindergarten Volume 1 um, under the artist name Meg, the letter N, Doug. All right, moving on, it is time to do our, um, we are just, I forgot how long everything takes. Um, we're going to do our morning message, and Kinsey, I'm going to have you help me with the morning message, okay? Well, wait, wait for a second. Well, right now. No, just wait for a second. Okay. Oh, that song. All, done. All right. Oh, it's beautiful. Would you like to show everybody what you've done? Kinsey filled out her daily sheet. She put her name at the top. On the bottom. K I N Z I E. Kinsey, what day of the week is it today? Tuesday. Tuesday. What did you color in today? Rainy and stormy. Okay. And how are you feeling? Happy, sad, and kind of tired. Today. Yeah. Awesome. Thank you for filling that out. Because it rained last night and stormed last night. All right. Do you want to sit in the chair with me? Mm -hmm. Let's see. I need to actually scoot this over just a little bit more. I can get the chair in the picture. There we go. All right. I'm going to sit in the chair. I'm going to sit on my lap. Ah. Hey! Yeah. Okay. Oh. We'll use the big pointer today. All right. So we're going to do another repeat after me. Okay? So I'm going to go first, Kinsey. And you're going to repeat after me. Okay. All right. You all, all point. I'll point with the pizza pointer. Here we go. It's yours now. Welcome class. Your turn. Welcome class. My turn. Today is Tuesday, September 8th. Your turn. Today, Today is Tuesday, September 8th. My turn. Today is our first day of class together. Ooh, that was a long sentence. Can you remember all of that? And it's my first day of class. Mm -hmm. today, today is our first day. day of class together. My turn. What did you do over the weekend? Your turn. What? Did you do over the weekend? Love, Miss Megan. Now, love, Miss Megan. This looks awesome, except there are some things that are wrong. Hmm, Kinsey, can you help everybody at home figure out what is wrong with our message today? Huh? What's wrong? Actually, can you stand over to the side so they can see it? What's wrong? Right here. What's wrong with our message? That's next to the end. Okay. Now, do you remember, Kinsey, when we read, what do we need at the beginning of sentences? What type of a letter do we need? A W, no. a M. We need what's called a capital letter. Okay? Now, and those are kind of capitalized. Each letter of the alphabet is capitalized. has two types of has two letters that look different, but they mean the same thing. We have a capital letter and a lowercase letter. And today, we'll just show you A, okay? On this card are two letter A's. We have a capital letter A and a lowercase letter A. It's also cloudy today. When we write our sentences, the very beginning of our word that starts our sentence needs a capital letter. So, Kinsey, let's take a look over here. Mommy, look. Yeah, I, I see that. And it's cloudy. I like it cloudy. Okay. Let's see here. Kinsey, welcome class. Where is the beginning of our next sentence? Stand over here so everybody can see. Stand over here. Today. Two. What needs to be capitalized on the word today? What letter? 
T. A T. Very good. So we're going to put... All capital letters. I'm going to put the three lines underneath and you can put the capital T. Okay? One, two, three. And you put the capital letter T on top. Like this. A capital T. Capital letter T. We go across and down. We use some two different lines to make a T. Across We make and an, an, down. a horizontal line. Okay. And we make a vertical line. Okay. Almost. No, I want to do it again, but you can just erase it. That was a lowercase t. We need a capital T. So, oh, I can do a cross and mm -hmm. down. No, let me help you, please. Okay. We go across, and then we start back in the middle of that and go down. Okay, so scooch over so everybody can see. All right, capital T for today is, I'm going to do the next two. Wait, wait, mommy, mommy. Scooch over, please. Mommy. What? Yeah, we're not doing all of these today. I forgot how... Um, much time everything takes. So a capital T, T on today, because it's the beginning of a sentence, is Tuesday. Wait, mommy. Tuesday. Please stop talking. Tuesday is the name of something. Tuesday is the name of what? The day of the week. week. And September is the name of what? Well, the birthday. The month of the year. Very good. And well, the birthday. Now we have another sentence. What do we need to do with this T? Make a capital T. Make a capital T. One, two, three. Capital T. Scooch over. Mommy, mommy. Today is our first scooch over mommy, day of mommy, class mommy. together. Last one. What did you do over the weekend? What what type of letter do we need here? A capital W. Mommy. Three lines. You want to make the capital mommy, W? Look. That's the end of the word. I think we started a little. I think we started a little advanced here. So capital W. Boop, 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 boop. All right, good job. All right. It says the capital W right there. That's Very how good. I know a capital W. Okay. Um, we are going to move on oh. to our weekend news. All right. Now, every Monday, we're going to do our weekend news. I'm going to do a little... Um, uh, a uh, shortened version of weekend news because we don't have much time to do it together. Um, but you can do your weekend news at home. And Wells is going to do her weekend news a little bit later. So I'm going to show you what we're going to do for weekend news. Now, parents, if you're watching, um, I, I differentiate this for younger kids and older kids, okay? I'm going to show you how I do it for the younger kids right now. I need you to get off my lap for right now. Thank you. And then I'll show you what I do for the older kids another day. But for the younger kids, meaning like preschool age and some kindergarten age, that are still learning how to write their letters, um, I do what I call mm. ghost writing with them, okay? Now, let's see here. Let's talk about what did we do over the weekend. The weekend are the days that we're not at school. So, please stop. Mm -mm, put that away. No, no, I'm gonna no I, don't away. Want, I don't want you doing that. Um, Kinsey, what did you do over the weekend? Um, Come scooch back so that they can see. Okay. And while we're at Daddy's house, um, I got a new um, Spider-Man truck. Okay. And it had something that chews the hell of it. Okay. What else did you do this weekend? Oh, I forgot to tell you one thing. What? Being with my sister at Daddy's house. So you, I, okay, so, so you played with your sister, okay? Uh -huh. So what I like to do is I like to figure out what they did over the weekend and then come up with a very simple sentence for them to work on, okay? So Kinsey is going to write, I played with my sister. So I'm going to show you what I'm going to do for Kinsey. And Kinsey and I are going to work on this a little bit later, but we're going to start this in class, okay? So Kinsey said, I played with my sister. So what I'm going to do for Kinsey is I'm going to take a pencil. Yeah, but I wanna do we do not need scissors. Put the scissors away. Thank you. I'm going to go get a pencil. I'm going to take the word I and I'm going to very lightly make little dots so that she can trace over my letters. I don't know. Can you see that? Yeah. Got a puzzle. Okay. Can you please put that away? I, this is a pencil though. now we, I like to write phonetically when they're first learning how to write, which means that they can help sound out the words. So Kinsey, 
Let, let's talk about the word played. P -p -p -p. What makes the p sound? P. P. So we're going to make a P. I thought a B. What's next? P. L. 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 What letter makes the L sound? Kinsey, stop. Please. Wait, I'm taking No, it. let go, please. Thank you. I want to trace over. You will when we're all done. Okay? What makes the L sound? I'm just going to take this out and I put it on the table. To, no, I need for you to listen I to me. I want it on the table. If you were at school at Kinder Haven, would you be doing this with your teachers? Mm -hmm. Sit up, please. You're not going to get this until we're done. Okay? What makes the L sound? L, very good. Pl A A. What makes the A sound? What letter makes the A sound? A. Ah. A. Yep. Play. Yeah. 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 What letter yeah. makes the yeah sound like a yo yo? Y. What? J. What? <laughs> Clay. Yeah. Yeah. Like a yo yo. Um. A bird. Okay. I don't want you to be silly right now. I want you to focus. Y makes the y sound. And what makes the d sound? Play d, d. D. D, very good. All right, I'm not going to continue this right now because it's going to take a really long time. So you get the idea. So for played, we, we spelled it P-L-A-Y-D, played. That way when she goes back, since she doesn't know all of the different rules of uh, reading and writing yet, which she'll learn when she gets older, um, she can then help sound it out and read it back. So I played with... With would be W I T H, my my is a sight word, so I would spell it M Y. Sister would be S I S T R, so S I S T R. Okay, we're gonna finish that later because that is gonna take up too much time on camp kindergarten today. So we are gonna move on after we do a little brain break, which I think we'll do the banana chair. Get off the chair, please. That was my brain break. Okay, you ready? But Repeat after me. M Mommy, that was my No, we don't just lounge in the chair for a brain, brain break. All right, ready? Bananas unite. Bananas unite. Bananas split. Bananas split. Peel. Bananas. Peel, peel. Bananas. Hey, peel. Bananas. Peel, peel. Bananas. Hey, lean to the left. Lean to the right. Peel your banana and take a bite. Hey. Good job. Oh, can you still have some bananas to eat from this morning? Take a bite. All right. We are going to move on to the letter A. Kinsey, can you erase the board for me, please? Thank you. The letter A. Where's the other big one? There's one over there. I don't know where. The, oh, there's one up there, too. The letter A. This is called... The A Book, okay, by Jillian Cutting, illustrations by Jan Vanderboo. Letter A, repeat after me. Alligator. Alligator. Apple. Apple. Ant. Ant. Acrobat. Acrobat. Animals. Animals. Ambulance. What sound did you hear at the beginning of all of those words? Alligator. Apple. Ant. Acrobat. Animals. And ambulance. Kinsey, what sound did you hear at the beginning? Alligator. Ah, ah, ah. Can you all say that with me? Ah, ah, ah. Does ambulance a? Can you please stop talking for a moment, please? A for an ant. A for an ant in an an apple. Look at that ant in that apple. The ant is in the apple. A for an acrobat. An acrobat is somebody that's able to do some very interesting, silly things. A for an acrobat in an ambulance. Uh-oh. Kinsey, why do you think the acrobat is in the 
ambulance. Because it got hurt. He must have gotten hurt. Why do you think that? Because he was because he was doing so many Maybe because he was doing some dangerous things and he got hurt. So he had to go in an ambulance. The ambulance takes you to the hospital. A for an alligator. A for an alligator. Uh, this one doesn't really work as well. Asleep. Look at that. Look at that alligator asleep. He's got one eye open and one eye closed. Maybe he's keeping one eye open and one eye closed so he can see if there's anything coming at him. An apple a day keeps the doctor away. An apple a day, that's what they say. Do you like apples? Ah, ah, apples? I like ah, ah, apples. Me Do you? Too. Let's sing our, our alphabet. All right. So, Kinsey, can you, let's see, I'm going to hold this up over here, and I'm going to try to point to the alphabet as we sing it. All, All right? All the way up to 100. Here we go. Let's sing our ABCs together. Here a, we go. A, B, B C, D, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. Now I know my ABCs. Next time won't you sing with me? All right. Nice job. Okay. What? My bow. Wait, Would you like me to help you put that back in? Mm -hmm. This is my bow. It fell off. Okay. So mommy's pretty. All right. Wait, in mommy, our packet. How it goes. Yes. In our packet for this week, we have. Um, we're going to be talking about the letter A. Um, a for apple. Um, we're going to talk about how to write the letter A. We B are going to work on that tomorrow. Apple. Can you please stop talking? We're going to work on that tomorrow because we're almost to the end of our time today already. Oh my goodness, that went by so fast. I think I planned a little bit too much for an hour. Um, so I don't want to end our time without reading a story. So let's read a story. Wait, wait for a second. Got to find my blue coat. I'm not waiting. I'm going to start reading. Corduroy. Wait, it's on yours. What? It's over here. Okay. Corduroy goes to school. Do you want to help me with the flaps? Based yeah. on the character created by Don Freeman. Pictures by Lisa McHugh. Let me get a little bit closer to the camera here. Me too. Corduroy goes to school. It's a beautiful morning and Corduroy is at school early so he can play with his friends. They swing on the swings and go down the slide. They climb on the bars. Here comes the bus. It's time to go to your classroom, Corduroy. There's the teacher. There's a little bird. There's the bus. And there's one of the stuffies. All right, scooch over. There's the bus. There's the bus. Corduroy talks to his friends while he puts away his backpack. This week, it is Corduroy's turn to take care of the class pets. He wakes up the bird gives water to the gerbil, and feeds the fish. There's the bird. There's the fish. And you just scooch over a little bit. I'll get the gerbil over here. I'll get the gerbil. There's the gerbil. And there's his water mm -hmm. bottle. At the beginning of the day, everyone sits on the rug, and the teacher reads the class a book. She then talks about the letter of the day. We're reading a book. Yes. Today's letter is B. Everyone has brought in something for show and tell that begins... With a B. Box. What did Corduroy bring? Ooh, box. Corduroy brought a box. And what's in the box? Coin. Buttons. Buttons. And what did the dog bring? He brought a b b boat. A boat. boat. And what did the penguin bring? A b uh, b balloon, balloon that's hiding a bike. This would have been a great story to read in the next week. Look, a bumblebee. Very good. All right. 
Wait, wait. Did we already did that one, sweetheart. Oh, we didn't. Oh, you're right. A bug. Can you scooch over? Because when you put your head like this, then everybody can't see. Okay? My head hurts. Now it is time to play. Corduroy could build a city in the blocks and he could try on hats in the costume corner. He could look at books at the reading corner. He could put together a puzzle in the quiet corner. What should Corduroy do? Read a book. Read a book. Play, play with dress ups. Put on other dress ups. And put in the block. Play in the blocks. Read another book. It's time to get back to work. Corduroy's class is practicing their letters and learning colors. Corduroy gets out his crayons, markers, paints, and paper. Corduroy makes a big blue A, a big red B, and a big purple C. Nice job, Corduroy. There are his crayons. And there's the birds outside, and there's what he's working on. There's the letter B, and the letter A, and the letter C. Okay, watch out, please. Wait. Sweetheart, come on. Wait, wait. Nope, we'll move it down. All that work has made everyone hungry. Today is Corduroy's teacher's birthday, and they're having a special treat. Cupcakes and juice. The class sings, happy birthday. B is for birthday, Cor says Corduroy. What's in this box? Scooch over, please. Birthday present. A birthday present? And, wait, and a medal. Okay, what's under the cake? Some cupcakes. Ooh, those look good, don't they? A little card. Happy birthday, love, Corduroy. All right, last page. At the end of the day, Corduroy's teacher asks the class to draw a picture of what they liked best about their day at school. Then they put all their drawings on the blackboard. What a busy day it was. Here's the penguin. Penguin. Some chalkboard drawings. A backpack. With a bear in it. Very good. All right. That is the end of our story. Now, our story um, talks about going to school. Now, Kinsey. Like my camp kindergarten. Camp kindergarten is Kinsey School. Does your school look just like the school in this book about corduroy? Or are there some things that are different? Some things that are different. What is different about your school and corduroy school? Um, I have toys at my school. So corduroy has toys at his school. Well, I have a, a playhouse at, my, at Blue Class. Right, but now we're talking about camp kindergarten. Um, do you do you go to school? No. Do you get on a bus? No. No, that's something that's different. Can you think of something that's the same with you and Corduroy going to school? Um, we both have backpacks. You both have backpacks. What else? Um, we both don't bring stuffies. Okay. Do we read books at school? Yes. And does Corduroy read books at school? Uh-huh. Yeah. Do you have friends that maybe aren't here with you, but they are learning with you? Mm -hmm. Does Corduroy have friends that are learning with him? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. We are going to sing one last song to end our time. We went over a bit. Um, but that's okay. So, what? let's sing one last song. I want to be all you need. Do you want to see my blue color? Daddy's favorite color. Okay. It's this color We're going to sing... This is my dad's favorite color, and your mommy found it, so she gave it to me. This is called Feeling. Another Miss Megan original. Here we go. I've got these feelings, feelings, feelings inside. Sometimes I want to laugh.
long enough. I've got these feelings, feelings, feelings inside. Sometimes I want to laugh, ha ha. Sometimes I want to cry. I've got these feelings, feelings, feelings inside. Let's take a look and figure out why. Let's take a look and figure out why. Last time. Let's take a look and figure out why. All right, that time went by so quickly. Thank you so much for joining us. We won't be done today without some birthday announcements. Just a reminder that if it is your birthday and I don't say your name, and it's, it's not because I don't care about you, it is because I just didn't know. Um, for it's parents that are watch, it is parents that are watching. Um, please let me know in my nightly post. Um, comment on the nightly post with your uh, the next for the if your child has a birthday. Please wait until the night before and then comment on the post that I put up with your child's birthday and how old they are. And it's, all, it's almost well. All right, we had some birthdays. And, and Please stop you, talking, thank no, you very much. It's not your turn right now. All right, we had some birthdays that passed. Simon turned four, Nicholas turned four, Tyler turned five, Haven Harold turned four, Olivia turned six, Brady turned four, and Eli had a birthday. Today's birthday, Evelyn and Annie turned four, Ryan and Riley turned five, Ella, Riley, Rihanna, Riley and Rihanna, and Benjamin all turned six, and today, September 8th, we have a golden birthday. Do you know what a golden birthday is? A golden birthday is when you turn the age that is the same as the date. So, today is September 8th, and guess what? It is Brooklyn's eighth birthday today. She turns eight on the eighth. So happy golden birthday to you, Brooklyn. If it is your birthday, happy birthday. Let's it's sing some happy birthday. And did you know that happy it's all Happy birthday to my you. Sister's birthday. Happy birthday Wait, to I tell you. Them you are interrupting and what? it's very rude. Well, I was you hold on to that thought and you can tell me when we're done. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday if it's your birthday. Day. Happy birthday to you. All right. Did what you did you know, want to say, Kins? Did you know that everyone, it's almost Wells' birthday? It is almost Wells' birthday. All right. Thank you for joining us today. We'll be back here tomorrow at 8.30. Trying to get everything all oh, done in our 45 fun. minutes to an hour together. So remember, what makes you different is what makes you beautiful. Always be kind. Mommy, you Goodbye. and me and Mother will talk. That's right, we are all wearing purple. All Mommy, right. did you know that my 